Okay, let us continue. Isaac and his mother lived alone in a small house. This here is a good game, and to I feel like if I play this with a chat, with we can finally see the ending that I missed. Vinny, thoughts on Strange New Worlds? I'll tell you about it. I'm just gonna play as Isaac again. Losing streak, negative 27. Hell yeah. Milk. After taking damage, you gain tears up for the rest of the room. Um, Strange New Worlds is... is I, Dave and I have a, a discussion about it. Chocolate milk. Chargeable tears. I'm down to try a chocolate milk run. I mean, Isaac pogged. The video is not up yet, but Dave and I talk about Strange New Worlds a little bit while we play a uh, turtle game. And um, the way I described it, I haven't finished it yet. I was waiting to watch it because I wasn't sure I wanted to subject myself to more Kurtzman Trek. But after watching it, I can safely say it is pretty good. It's like decent episodes of Voyager slash Enterprise. There is definitely potential the show could get better. And it actually kind of amazes me that Paramount Plus would allow a show like this to exist, as it feels like Star Trek. Cast is pretty good. Some of the characters fall flat for me, but some of them are actually really good. And um, they do self-contained little episodes, and I'm generally enjoying it, but I've only watched like four or five of the episodes. Shocked, I tell you. Shocked. But yeah, I was waiting for like a decent chunk of episodes to uh, come out before I watched it because I didn't want to waste my time with more Discovery X-esque um, all the characters cry whenever they need to get emotions across. And it's, it's not that. So, and there's like some hope in it, you know? It's it's nice to watch a show that doesn't have to necessarily parallel our own just like hellscape. It's it's nice to watch a show that has the um, the stuff from the the TNG and the TOS that I really enjoy, which is to say, you know, hope for the future, really. Uh, new RLM video, yeah, they you know I watched it while I was doing other stuff, and I'll say that it's always good to have a new video from them. And I agree that the last episode of Kenobi was better, but I do not understand how they like that show. Like, I'm just, I, I'm sorry to, to Rich and Mike. I don't know what Picard did to you. The secret room won't be attached to the boss room for future notice. Oh, thank you. I mean, I know they didn't love the show, but there were things that they, they said that I was like, Really? That? Alright. Which is a shame, because I was waiting for them to release their video so I could have an opinion about the show, but I... It turns out my opinion differs from theirs, so now what the fuck am I gonna do? Oh no. Maybe these chocolate milk tears weren't all that good of an idea. Ah, oh, fuck. Yeah, I'm not really, uh... I'm not really feeling them chalky milk tears, sorry. The real opinion was inside of you all along. Vinny, become a cringe trarian. Maximum cope. Lead pencil. Every 15 tears fired, you fire a cluster of tears. I've never seen this, I don't think. Oh, that's neat. I like the graphic of the pencil in Isaac's eye. That's pretty cool. Um, yeah, I have the D6. But yeah, the Obi-Wan show did genuinely have a couple things I liked, and there were some good... Some good and bad Vader moments, some good and bad Kenobi moments, uh, and then the rest of it was just pretty embarrassing, as far as I'm concerned. I don't- I just- I don't know, man. Whatever. But, uh, at least I can say, weirdly, even though my hatred of Paramount Plus and Kurtzman 
almost prevented me from watching Strange New Worlds, I can say that I'm kind of enjoying it. And it pains me to say that because, I, you know, again, I don't have Paramount Plus and I'm hoping if people wish to watch it on my recommendation, you know, maybe also don't have it because it's, it's kind of trash. I mean, watch the Halo show if you want to learn more about that. What else? Oh, uh, I watched some of Beavis and Butthead new movie. And I thought it was pretty good so far. I'm enjoying it. I haven't finished it. I'm halfway through. And I laughed a number of times. And I, it's weird because it, it works with the fish out of water premise. Some of the, the animation's a little stanky. Like some of the, the art is a little stanky, but I guess that's kind of Beavis and Butthead tradition. But it's funny. And it's surprising how much I enjoyed it so far. I'm hoping that it delivers, but, um... Vinny, why do you never watch movies in full? Oh, I do! I do plenty of times. I just... I fell asleep. There we go. There we go. Because it's not a card game he is playing. You think it... you know what? You joke about it, but I've fallen asleep playing Slay the Spire before. Confirmed. Yeah, the card games are supposed to put others to sleep. What the fuck? I also have um, another demo showcase. I don't know when that's uploading, but there's some some more interesting stuff that you will see. Um, I need keys, right? Oh, it's Dingle again. Shitty boss. Wow, rainbow poop. Still don't remember what that does. Also, I guess I kind of want to make a, a quick note about my, um... It's a full heal. Oh, okay, I wasted it? That's sick. Okay, this, this lead pencil was much better for Dingle. I wanted to make mention at some point about my, um... Oh, my occasional cynicism... ...in regards to, like, shows and stuff. Which is to say, fuck everything, everything sucks. I... I would say that my cynicism when it comes to TV shows and movies and, and games... I'm discerning. And I try to be because I play a lot of stuff. But I think it's really easy, like, a lot of it is still not, like... You know, we're doomed kind of cynicism. It's more just like, oh, I don't like the thing I'm watching or playing. Or it, it looks like a cash grab. Diablo Immortal. But, um, I think it's a little too easy to fall into the trap of cynicism. And I'm... I have to catch myself. And I do think that it's, especially if you have reasons to be cynical, it's hard not to be. But... It really doesn't always lead to the best results. And it starts to... You know, it starts to turn into a... ...a habit. And then habits kind of dig you deeper. So, I guess the point I'm trying to make is... ...you know, even though I can be discerning and, and sometimes I'm like... ...oh, fuck Star Trek Picard or whatever. I think cynicism for, like, everything... ...especially when things feel kind of hopeless, which... ...you know... ...happens a lot... ...like, in the world. There's always got to be some hope. I think you, if you listen to my music, you might hear it. Like, it's all over my songs. It, it has to be, because I can't... That's, that's a place I don't want to go back to. It's just pure bleak. Um, and I think... Even if you have plenty of reason to be cynical... It's worth just being careful about it. That's really all I'm trying to say. I know it's a kind of a word salad that I just made there, but... 
uh, I have to sometimes think about these things in order to catch myself. And also, considering I have an audience. Start of every room, every enemy gets poison effect. Oh, okay. So that, that like, it's like another layer of me thinking about stuff and how I present what I talk about, but also just day-to-day -day life. That's why it's nice to just disconnect and go feed a duck once in a while or go for a, a bike ride or, you know, try to enjoy what is good, like a fried Oreo sandwich. Maybe not that. So Toxic Shock is really good, isn't it? Oh man, how do I... Damn it. I was really hoping I could get both of those. Vinny, have you seen the Oreo pizza? No, but I saw that she says... Found a cricket pizza. At some fair. I don't know what kind of, like... You know, James Bond villain thought that up, but I don't want to have anything to do with that. There we go. Oop, explodes for 100 damage when destroyed. Um, chat, this is one key, right? Okay. Uh, Guppy or the Mark? On use, convert one heart container to salt three so oh, fuck that. I'll reroll. Guppy. Plus nine lives, respawn with one HP, sets your red heart containers to one. Uh... No, I think that's- that's probably not- I've done that before, plenty of times. I just don't have any faith that I can succeed at that. I do have soul hearts. Yeah, I got a bunch of them. Uh... I- yeah, I don't- I don't want to do it. Sorry. God damn it. I just collected a bunch of money. It doesn't remove soul hearts. What about soul hearts? Which I'm very happy is almost back. Um, I'll save my money. No, I know, I'll just die. That's the problem, is I, I know that I will die, and then I'll get stuck on a boss, and keep dying on the boss with one HP. Dormarmu. I've come to come. Doctor Strange, what are you saying? Okay, so I, I kind of remember what I have to do, so, um... I have to touch that white flame and then get to the... ...item room? Where does the mirror come in? Remind me. Okay, so... Go through mirror, then go to item room. Touch fire... Then, mirror. Right. Oh, good, those right, those explode. Fucking god, get rid of this trinket. How do you get rid of trinkets again? I'm holding control and nothing is happening. There we go. 
Vinny, you can fight the boss twice. You you do know that I will die if I do that, right? Like, that will be insta-death. Reach out and touch flame. That was a nice thing that happened. Um, garbage, when I saw them live, they were not garbage, in fact, but they also were garbage. They did a little tribute to uh, Andy from Depeche Mode. I probably mentioned that, but it was nice. Bomb tears again. <sighs> um... Cockporn2, says a chat member. Yep. Oh, it's, it's a spicy item, I know that. It's a spicy meatball. With, yep, yeah, I guess, um... I guess fuck the lead pencil at that point. Oh. Whoa. I guess I can destroy those. Damn it. Don't mind me, just looking for secrets. Super secrets, whatever secrets, doesn't matter. I mean, the lead pencil still works. There it is. Uh. Boss first. Sick. Blood clot applies only for left eye. If you want to know what I thought about the Nintendo Direct Mini Partner Showcase... Showcase! That gives you a free coupon to Red Lobster if you, um... Release live roaches into your home. Uh, I have... There's a video on the Full Sauce channel where I talk about it. Pack is back! In another adventure remake! I didn't... I didn't know what was a remake and what was a sequel. I, I couldn't fucking tell. I just don't know anymore, chat. I just don't know anymore. Oh no. Oh no! Where are you going? Uh, probably not to the boss, right? That would be bad. Okay. You can get an extra boss item if you do. Yeah, but you'll- you'll only... Oh, that's really good. Actually, that uh, I have bomb tears. If you do that, if you take one hit, you're dead, right? Unless you have you have the mantle. Two with mantle. I don't have the mantle.
Vinny has not unlocked Mantle for Lost yet. Sorry, chat. Yeah, I would love to, but I just don't trust my own gameplay. Maybe if I d hadn't taken a year-long break from this game with several fucking cocks floating all around my face in my nightmares. be as specific as possible when I say several. There we go. Even though I need keys more than I need bombs right now. Repentance actually had a massive update in March fixing a lot of things. I think Ed said that there was going to be another potential update with just balance changes and stuff. This is the game that never ends. Infinite updates. <laughs> well, thank you for joining, chat members. Okay, need some stuff. Keys, perhaps. Oh! I mean, I guess you could keep updating this game. You just add new items. I don't know how you'd think of items that aren't already in the game, but I'm, I'm sure it's possible. More alternate paths, more bosses, more enemies, more blood clots. Ow. Alright, we got a little dumpy here. Dump familiar. Dumpy farts to deflect projectiles away. Yeah, a little... A little dumpy sounds fine. Ow, fucking spiders. Playing this again, after having played Neon Abyss for a while, I'm like, oh, they just took... They just took these concepts and put it in a side-scrolling roguelite. Like, it's the same fucking game. It's not a bad thing. But, like, even down to the challenge rooms, it's like three waves, and then you get an item, maybe. It's, it's really interesting. Ah, oh, Steam Sale. I'll take that. Take that. Um, remind me what the Hermit does again, because I always forget. Actually, I'll just read it. Teleports you to the shop. Oh, um... So that is a thing that sucks. Is... Ed, Ed, please fix. Ed, please fix. When you have... Oh, shit, I didn't mean to do that. When you have the pencil in your eye, and then you try to shoot bomb... Whenever the pencil procs, it shoots bomb, like, in front of you.
Why? I don't know. I thought it'd be fun. I had fun. Should have saved it for the next floor. God damn it. Dumpy, please. Oh, God damn it! I always lose track of that goddamn bomb. I have to fucking be very, very aware of it. Damn. Shot speed up, one card, planetarium chance. Uh, my brother in Christ, you took the power up. I know, I it's I didn't realize that the um the lead pencil was gonna be a nightmare. Truthfully. Vinny, you missed Devil Room. That's sick. This guy are sick. Oh, man. For future reference, if you see a devil room, don't leave. I, I know. I just... I didn't see it, and then... I don't know what happened. Like, momentary lapse of reason? Don't jump in the wrong hole again. No, I won't. I won't. Not this time. Yeah, the horror sting uh, when you do the devil room or when you unlock it. I'll get used to hearing it, and know that it will be something extraordinary. But I forgot. I can't find the regular secret room. I've given up. Alright, let's keep going. Curse of the maze! God damn it. Chat, you know, I've at this point decided that this is a good game. I think it took me about, you know, 300 or so hours. I mean, th these aren't Mike numbers. Mike has like, what? 2,000 or more hours in Isaac? Yeah, something like that. But I finally decided this is a good game. Oh, I got a lucky penny. That's nice. It's an ass penny.
I'll take that. I can't wait for the lead pencil to proc and me to take damage. There we go. I think that was worth it. Oh god, right, it's the Curse of the Maze. Forgot about that for a second. Okay, there's one. This time, I'm not gonna go down the wrong hole. Please no one mention Cockhorn at the moment of truth. Please. Why is chat smiling or putting kappas as if I don't know what that already means. Luck up. A video popped up on my uh, YouTube of Norm talking with Dennis Miller, and David Spade is in is in the room. And he's talking about like you know octogenarians with Viagra because at the time it was new. He's like these these guys have hard cocks for like six hours, eh? Right? He's like now they need to make a pill to make people attracted to the old men with the hard cocks. Like, yeah, I guess you're right, Norm. I guess you're right. I mean, he did it way better than I could, but yeah. Your Norm voice is easily the worst voice you have. Well, I thought the Jeff Goldblum voice was pretty bad because it was pretty much indistinguishable from my voice. But I'll take that and I'll I'll use it as a uh, as a I'm shit out of luck because I I cannot do a better Norm voice than that. <laughs> Worse than Jay Leno. Well, the Jay Leno one is isn't supposed to be accurate. It's just supposed to be like. You know, silly. See, for you, it's either, um, you have two ways to look at it. Worst, as in, like, it's not close to who I'm trying to do an impression of. Or worst, as in, oh god, it's painful, I don't want to hear it. Get the range and luck up, why not? Um, alright. Let's, uh... Let's go get the knife. Fucking wish there was a key in here somewhere. Did I get the, uh, super secret room? Watch the super secret room be... ...next to the, um... The item room. Shit. Hmm. I'm just looking. Don't don't mind me. I'm just looking for secrets. Your Gonzo voice is your most accurate impression. That's that's weird to me because that's a voice I never practiced. Your terrible Kurt Cobain impression is top-tier absurdist humor, dude. Someone at Too Many Games told me that. Like, I, I met someone who watched my stuff. Like, they I guess they recognized me even with my mask on. 
And then they were like, um, I do that, like, all the time. I'm like, I'm so sorry. Yeah, you know. Yeah. I don't mind. Again, like, if I did not want to be recognized at all, I, I just wouldn't go to these things. I, you know, I know what I'm doing. It's more an issue of, uh, do I want to do a panel? Do I want to do a signing? And the answer is no, truthfully. That could change in the future, because, you know, all things must pass. But at the moment, yeah, I'm just, I'm happy if someone recognizes me and wants to stop and talk for a couple minutes. I prefer one-on-one, -on -one, like, talking to a human being. It's just, somehow, Palpatine returned. Somehow my channel got big enough to the point where I was signing for, like, hours at a time, which made no sense to me whatsoever. I was like, how does this even reflect the number of subscribers I have on YouTube? It doesn't. It's very flattering. But it's- it's a weird skill to be able to do that for hours. Like, I saw Scott the Waz, and his voice was all, like, gone, and he was tired, and he enjoys meeting people, but at the same time, like, he was going for, like, hours. And I- I told him, I was like, yeah. Yep, I remember those days. Oh, fuck. But honestly, he is one of- I, you hear this a lot. Oh, fuck. But Scott is actually one of the nicest people I've met in the YouTube world. And- and the, uh, and he's very... He's very easy to talk to. And, uh, I would say that he deserves his success. He puts the work in. Even if you don't love what he does, he does put the work in. And I think... I think he deserves his- I think he deserves it. Wow, why did this one have to be a fucking miserable nightmare? Whereas the one I, I played the other day was not as bad as this. Jesus. So, so long, um, soul hearts, I guess. Unironically, skill issues. Yeah, I know. I just don't want to say it out loud, but you're you're not wrong. Chat, I don't want to miss an item room. What options do I have? Guess I have this as an option. Yeah, spiders. Yeah, sp yeah, fucking spiders. Yeah. Oh, those are blue spiders. Range down, and I found pills. That's nice. Oh, man. I'm not going to be able to get that item. And lower yourself to 1 HP and do the challenge room. Do I want to? You have a higher chance of a planetarium if you skip the item room. Okay. Um, let's search for legit rocks, if there are any. None. Cockporn! You don't have the planetarium unlocked. Oh.
mausoleum. I kind of remember this from when Repentance was a separate thing. <sighs> wow, cool. That is so fucking cool. I'm gonna save that, um, soul heart, or white heart, until after I defeat the boss. Tinted rock in the previous room. Is there? I kinda- I can't tell. Oh, that- oh, right, I see. Chat, it's not tinted rock, it's legit rock. Cool fucking enemies. Did they just bat that bomb away? Oh my god! I've never seen that. Still do not have... a key. Any plans on visiting, revisiting Spelunky 2? Um, not right now. I'm gonna re-roll this. Five bombs, bombs will explode. And across- that'll get me killed. Spin to win? No. Bad items. At least there's a lot of blue torches. When you go into a boss room here, you can't get back out. Good to know. That poison is helping tremendously. That's the second floor, not this one. Sometimes a little bit of misinformation isn't... In it's, it's, um, unintentional misinformation, you know? So, chat, I was going through the clip channel because I just noticed that the clip of me talking about the Clussy resurgence has, um, gotten a lot of views. And I thought about this for a minute. I was like, well, what would be the ultimate clip? What would spike the algorithm and what would be the clip that everyone would want to see? And I, I figured it out. So, it's the Mario movie. It gets announced on Family Guy, right? There's a knock at the door. Oh my god! It's the Mario Brothers movie! That's like the time I went bowling and the ball tried to have intercourse with the pin. Eh, but I'm not into that. I like Clussy much better. Just then, the Mario movie takes off its mask and it kills Peter. It turns out, it was a traitor among us the whole time.
Oh, and Jerma is there too. That is the perfect clip. The ultimate clip. Gajillions of, of views. Fives of them, in fact. I don't want to blow up the fucking... Uh... Just leave and re-enter? Okay. Give coins to bum. Well, I'm getting some good battery charges, so we can- we can get a better item. Someone just said, hello, chat room, and I really enjoyed that. Usually it's, hello, chat. But that was very AOL of you to say that, chat member. Hmm. Alright, um, let us now... Go. Ooh. This, this dumpy has been helping. After dumpy is used, you have to touch him to wake him back up. Oh, that's how that is? So, can I, um... complete that bum? If that makes any sense? Angry Fly orbits around a random enemy until that enemy dies. Deals 30 contact damage per second. Well, Isaac is not hogging. Randomly increases 4 stats, randomly decreases 2 stats. Yo, what the fuck? Let's say Gish. Oh, the game Gish. I thought it was like Smashing Pumpkins album. We're gonna get two more rerolls because I really, really think that there's a, just an amazing item just waiting for us. Copium. Nah, bro. No. Watch. Watch. You- wait until you see this item that I'm gonna get. It takes a lot, but this bum will eventually pay out with a battery-based item. Oh cool, zero tier! Chance to shoot charming tears. Alright, we're going back up. A battery-based item, meaning, like, it's gonna replace the D6? No? Okay. Well, let's see if... ...this little fella likes 60-plus coins. Pay out. Come on, pay up. Pay up, lad. You can do it. You're no longer a bum. 
Jesus. I, I didn't get anything. Was that Japes? Stitches. Passively spawns a familiar that moves in the direction Isaac shoots. Unused, Isaac swaps places. Um... Sticky bomb tears. Not affected by luck. Um... No, I was wondering, like, would that stack at all? I'm gonna waste all of my coins on that bum, so that way I can get... I can, I can get the bum item, I swear, and I'm gonna get a good item. Yo, it's, it's gonna be awesome, I swear to god. It's not sunken cost fallacy. It's the it's not the fallacy. It's gonna work. This is not the sunken clussy. Come on, little fella. I just need you to just get that one last. Bit. Come on, one more, one more, one more. There you go. There we go. Two full charges. All the money's gone, and I got nothing from this bum. You lousy bum. Muddy Mud Skipper, what are you doing here? Belly Button. Spawns a random trinket. Grants one extra trinket slot. Bomb Bag. Drops one bomb pickup every two to three rooms. Alright, we'll get the question mark. Rerolls pedestal. This is... even worse. Oh. It's a good thing there's a shop here that I can afford. Take it. Vinny, am I going crazy or did the song say Among Us? No. Just a little bit, but not really. No, yeah. No, it, a little bit. It's a... no. Now chat is hearing the word sus. Cuphead DLC releases tomorrow. Will you stream it? Yes. Not tomorrow, but... I also want to finish that AI stuff I was doing. So I don't know when that's going to happen, but soon, hopefully. Um, yeah, I think I will. I mean, I'm going to stream it no matter what. I just don't know when. friend. Come on. You know you want them. 
Nice. Well, now what is he going to do with the 60-something coins that I gave him? In hell. Super secret rooms are usually very close to the boss room. I mean, that's what I thought. Maybe it's in the shop. Here we go. One more reroll. It is Robo Baby. Yeah. Sure. Oh God, no! Ow! It's not the best item, but it's it's certainly better than whatever the, the you know crap I was getting was. Ah, we could go for another reroll. I'll save it. I was pretty sure the super secret would be here, but oh well. Do I just try to use death to kill death? God, no. God, what are you doing? No, stop that. Um, range up, shot speed up. One black heart. I'm gonna re-roll that. Size down, speed up, spawns a random pill. What could go wrong? Super secret is south of the room to the right of the boss fight. Mate. You said that with such authority. Try the room that is far right than up. It's okay. Um... Not totally worth it all, but it's fine. Okay. Interesting room. Ah! Filth. Oh. I'm sorry, is there a point to this room? I just realized, what am I doing in here? Hey. 
Bad, bad room. Wait, I don't understand. How did I get this one, but not the... Oh, I think I need to... Yeah, there we go. Alright, that's weird. So much new things that I haven't seen. So much new things, jeez. Has Vinny beaten Mother on any other characters? Um... Let me see how many hours I have in this game, actually. Um... 109? And that's not counting the Switch version and the extra couple hundred I had in the original Isaac. Or is there a different thing that you're talking about? Never mind, then. I mean, I'm never going to 100% this game. I'm fine with that. It's just fun to play. And, uh, I think being able to see some of the new stuff is my real goal here, since, uh, I didn't really get to see any of the new endings. Is this Mondo Greed? I forget their names sometimes. Range Up still works on bombs when you have the bombs, right? I mean, I think it is, at least. Vinny, did you hear about the Into the Breach expansion? I did talk about it. I'm very, very excited for it. There's new music, too. Chat, is that X anything? No. Contagion. First killed enemy in the room will explode and poison all nearby enemies. I think that works pretty well with the other poison thing that I have, so I'll take it. Chat seems to like it. Fish head, it stinks. Spawn one blue fly when getting hit. I think that's probably better because I have bombs already. So I, I'm gonna I'm gonna get the fish head. Grant's flight for the current room. Okay, so what is the point of those buttons in that room that I hated? Because I could go back in there now. Is it at all worth it? Oh, you scock! Ooh! Two boss items spawn instead of one. So... It's too late for options, maybe you're right. Um, so is it not worth it to go back to that room and use flight in it? That specific room spawns treasure chests. Okay. Oh. Uh. Can 
now hold two trinkets. Or bracelet. Uh, I think I'm gonna get the purse when I, if I can, if I can afford it. Which means I may go back to that room then, there. Look at them whip around. Gee. Ah. Uh, Code Hanger is very good. Um, is it good for this build? Should I re-roll it? Oh, this, this just opened again. Uh, I opened it twice. Tears are always good to have. I shoot bombs, though. I'm gonna re-roll it. Rocket in a jar. If shooting, place bombs turn to rockets that fire in shooting directions. Oh my god. Oh my god! Let's see if this solves the problem. Yes, it does! I have a rocket launcher now. Amazing. I've never seen this build before, and I love it. Now all you need is homing. Yeah, pretty much. What? Someone say homer? No, homing. Uh, boy. A holding completely uncharged item. I guess there's no coming back, right? can get into the boss challenge room via the secret room. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. No, he can't. Oh, right. I tried. That's right. Uh, super secret room is not looking findable. Right about now. Maybe maybe the shop. Can't be the shop. Why is mom down here? Oh my god, is this super mom? Okay, chat, I need... Okay, so that's a devil room, right? I'm gonna go in there. We'll start with that. And then I'm going into the wall and not down the hole. Go into the meat door. Okay, so do I want the negative? Or do I want the Polaroid? The reason I ask is because this doesn't affect the ending, does it? Negative for more damage. Okay. Do 
Tears deal, deal more damage and travel the further they travel. So that, that'll work well with Rocket. Now we get a nice gross heart, too. Oh, we're here. Fuck. I wasn't expecting this. I mean, my robot baby is helping out. What am I taking damage from? Chat. Your rockets were blowing up on the bullets. Yeah, it looks like it. Why did I stop... Shooting. I don't- chat, I thought I was weaving in and out of bullets, of, of the red shots. I wasn't. I should have got the fucking Polaroid. <sighs> and then I was shooting missiles into... ...the thing. Personally, Vinny, I want you to know that the moment you turn on Ace Combat 7, I am leaving, in all caps. Okay, good. Dude. Like, you don't even have, have, have to tell me, you can just leave. Do whatever you- whatever pleases you. Homing tears. Oh. Alright, it's a good first item. But yeah, that sucks. Uh, that run was going very well. Those missiles were dangerous. I knew they would be dangerous. But the run was good. Vinny, why don't you play hard mode? You get unlocks for easy mode, too. You saw how I did on quote-unquote easy mode, right? Do I look like the kind of guy that could complete hard mode right about now? Fanny pack is good, but what, what is this? Mr. Me, usable familiar that can do tasks for you. Open doors or chests, fetch an item. Um, steal from the shop or devil. Give me until it dies. Oh, it's Mr. Me Seeks! I get it. Steal the fanny pack. Oh, it's a nice try. Vinny, you have to aim it. Oh, you have to aim it. Don't forget your die. I have to make a choice. Do I want to keep the D6 or do I want to keep this? D6 is way better. I mean, yes. Yeah. Shot speed up. That's good. Um... You can steal Devil Room stuff. Well, you also have to have Charge, which I do not have.
Okay, um... Shot speed up. This one card. I don't have planetarium, so is it worth it? Maybe I could re-roll that. It's a good item. Shot speed is also range. Reroll the me seeks. It helps unlock planetarium. I wouldn't mind unlocking planetarium. God, there's just so much shit to think about and do. Oh right, I don't have the energy for this. Um, all right, uh, sorry, Mr. Me seeks. I'm leaving. You have the health to enter the curse room. Oh man, if only I had a fucking me seeks right about now. So this is just more damage and uh, and and hearts. That's it. Well, this is going to be dumb. gonna be very dumb. Run is super dead, by the way. <laughs> yeah, it, it, it certainly appears like it, it, it will be. It definitely will be. You have a missile on your way? What does that mean? Oh, evade. I get it. It's doing an ace combat thing. Another devil room. What the fuck? Health up. Heals. Okay. It's the same one? Oh. Oh, wait. Oh, God. Insta dead. Shoot brimstone lasers in all four directions. Or should I reroll that? I'm gonna reroll it. The nail. Damage up speed down. Yeah. 
it gives HP and damage. I think for this build, it's exactly what I want. Um, it would have been nice to use it in a room with rocks, though. So now I have to fucking pass on another item. God damn it. Yeah, D6 is going. See you, D6. Bad run reset. Yeah. Well, not yet. Passing increases planetarium. Again, I have not unlocked planetarium. Here we go. This is gonna be it. This, this is the run. I can feel the power of passing items and playing like an asshole. I, I can't wait. That is my face after the last run ended the way it did. What's going to suck the most is the escape sequence. I have a feeling that's going to really suck. Peel. Damage up for left eye. Gonna take a chance. Mistakes were made, however can get the sad onion. How the fuck do you even get this? Mistakes into miracles, yeah. Only very specific items can get that. soul hearts. I'm going full bum. Lucky foot. Yeah, I'll take that. I mean, I don't have a choice anymore. Is this a legit rock? Chat? Two red hearts. Tinted rock in the mirror room below you. Take that. Bombs for boss room. Oh shit. Forgot about that. 
Oh, thank. Oh, God. Thank you, game. Thank you. Game had mercy. Still get the mines in the next floor. Okay, forgot about that. Let's see. No, you don't. No, 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 no. One more, one more item. All right. Sorry, bum friend. You're not going to fight the boss for extra items. No. It'll be like Indiana Jones when he goes, We are going to die! And then he does a sad face emote in real life, somehow. And then he says, Somehow, Palpatine has returned. Why in a Nord voice? Because he's Harrison Nord. Or Harrison Fjord. That's a good one, too. Rerolls all pickups in the room. In, in, in this room. Interesting. Bombs are key. those were items. Oh, no. All right. I mean, the upside is my tears are amazing. These little motherfuckers keep popping out, and I keep thinking they are t um, the, the rock that gives you attack power. This room is very, very frightening. Galileo! Tooth and nail, turn invincible every six seconds for one second. Uh. Free curse rooms, you say? Cool. Of items don't re don't charge when clearing rooms. They charge by dealing damage to enemies. 
Yeah, we got it. We got to get that. We got to get that. I don't have the money for it yet, but... Bomb the donation machine. I, I will. I'm going to look around first. I remembered that time. Ooh, shot speed up. Hell yeah. Uh, backseaters, yay or nay? I think, um, if I'm asking for help, sure. And I will ask for help a lot while I play this because I don't know all the things. And I like discovering things on my own to a certain extent, and then I'm just lost. And I want to try to actually win a run. So I'm gonna say, at the moment, I don't mind, but it's like, Vinny, fuck you, asshole! That would suck, I think. Yeah, that, that would probably suck. to buy that. I, I really would like that. So, chat, what am I going to do to get that? Purse room, I guess. Queensboro Bridge. Five bucks a man. Yeah, this guy, eh? He goes under the, the Queensboro Bridge. Queensboro Bridge, right? It is a terrible Norm impression. God, it's bad. Yeah. Luck up. Double luck up. Okay. Why would I go through there like that, knowing I can turn invincible? Chat, do we take a risk on a super secret room? I've also got bombs or key. Bomb the bum. I'm gonna look for... I'm gonna bomb the bum. And then I'm gonna look for a super secret room. Enemies have 5% chance to drop a penny when hit with your tears. Luck up. Oh, it's these tears. I like these. The secret is probably at the dead end with the pill. That's what it looks like to me. Um, but I might be able to fight the boss and make enough money. I'm gonna try... Well, I'm out of bombs now, but... Alright, that should be enough, so I'm just gonna fight the boss. Fuck it. Oh, it's this enemy, so that means more attempted... Uh, more, more potential money. One more coin needed. I'm 
stand still and take damage. Oh, God. Got it. Fuck. Oh, my God. Tears up, shot speed up. Should I go into the devil room now? I think I should, right? Uh... Mom's knife. Controllable knife attack. Deals two times damage. Well held six furthest possible different distance. I have no health. I homing knife with max tears. Shovels can guarantee crawl spaces. Good but hard to use. You can get the health via the nail. Now the run is over. It might not be. Again, the nail is going to give me the health I need, so... You need two hearts to get into the door? Oh yeah, I guess you're right. Turn on charge bars in the options. Oh yeah, I used to have those on. You can use the invincibility to go through the door for free. Oh yeah. You have tooth and nail. And I will fight tooth and nail to make sure this run doesn't pulp. The, the fucking, I need range, but the homing actually works really great with this. Okay, it got bombs. Very nice. I'm gonna destroy some mushrooms. Vinny, I love Grey Leno a whole lot. Thanks for making it. That's one. help from that room. This knife is very, very good. I don't regret it. That much is true. I do not regret this knife. But it's the nail is not charging as quickly as I would like.
4.5 volt is best used with bosses. Oh my god. Come on, we need a good item. Glaucoma. 5% chance to shoot concussive tears. Now we'll get the random one. Leprosy, you're tearing me apart. Uh, chat, what is this? On damage item? You produce a shield when you get hit. Alright. Book of Secrets, on use, highlights tinted and crawlspace rocks. I don't even know. It didn't show me the super secret. Shows boss. It gave you a compass. Okay, that's good. Remember, you need two hearts. <laughs> There's two hearts right there. Alright, we're gonna continue exploring a little bit. Because, um... This is getting a little worrying. Ugh! Well, that cleared the room instantly. Range up. <laughs> Spawns items based on the floor. just get that and use it. Give me a stapler, too. But it prevents Isaac from firing tears from one eye. Uh, that doesn't matter, does it? Okay. Someone just say Rob Schneider. Rob Schneider is a stapler! I guess I'll go do the thing now. Remember invincibility. Uh, yeah. I have that for later, but I have to do this. There's no situation where you can't juke mom simply by waiting. Okay, I'll be... I'll try to be aware of that. Boss first for nail. It's... it's too late, my friends. I'm here.
Concentration mode means no commentary. I don't know how I didn't take damage there, but I'm okay with that. It's worth it to go concentration mode sometimes. And now I have two knives. Gee, how come your mom lets you have two knives? Knives are huge! Could this possibly be the super secret? I'll find out. Isn't that nice? Absent chance to shoot poison tears. Turn to be a bomb. Bonus bomb. Uh. Does this work with knives? It does. Excellent. Applies only to the left eye. Damage up, range up. Spectral tears familiar. Deals three point. Nah, it's not worth it. That's one. No, it still takes hearts. Love these guitars. in full hearts now? What is that? It doesn't die. Oh, those are not to be killed. That in traditional... Oh, uh, fuck.
cool and good. And maybe I'm doing this for a reason. It's a little bit of farming. What, did, what do I have floating around me? Punching bad bag. Decoy familiar. Enemies will target him instead. I feel like... Oh, that's leprosy. I feel like this is pretty good. Take the unknown. Is this not good, the punching bag? Decoy gets me killed a lot, says chat member. Alright, fuck it. The peeper. It's not much of a thing, but it's something. Nine volt isn't an active item, right? Quicker charge. Just unlock the thing too, that's good. Uh, mm, magic fingers. Bit of a waste. Oh yeah, that was a waste. That's super cool. It's recharging quicker, though. I mean, that's good. Secret room. No secret room yet. There it is. That is... That is why we use the nail. Oh, now I get the steam sale. God damn it. the habit. Plus one charge when you get hit. It's absolutely fucking lootly. Bomb the reroll? No, 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 no. I think that, that may have saved the run. Um, is there any reasonable way to get those coins? It kind of doesn't seem like it. Oh, that was bad. I do have invincibility for a second, but I'm not very fast, so... Any legit rock? No. Diagonal walk between the spikes. I'll lose more health getting those coins than it than is worth it. Could the super secret room be here? It is. Uh... 
clear floor, collect money, then visit shop. We got the Pact. Uh, damage up, tears up. And we got Eye of the Occult. Occult, then Pact. Is that, um... Uh... Occult, controllable tears. Do not take occult. Skip too little HP. Yeah, I'm not crazy about my HP amount. I'm probably gonna skip. Packed refunds hearts. I mean, you get two, but then you lose one. It's damage up and tears up. That doesn't sound... ...that amazing. I kind of like that I have one red heart. Sorry, chat. I'm not getting either. You're at the tier cap, don't worry about it. Grant's flight. to spawn the double version of pickups. Can you double a soul heart? I can't get it, but... No? Alright. I don't even know why I rerolled. Bomb the reroll machine. I only have one coin, so that's not gonna happen. But I did it anyway. Uh, let's keep moving. Bomb the shopkeepers. You have more skulls in the sacrifice room. Yes, but I don't have a ton of bombs. I tried. Uh. Uh. Oh god, no! Oh. I gotta sneeze! I'm good. <sighs> Couldn't sneeze. It wasn't happening. It just hurt. It was the pain of sneeze without the sneeze. I like that I have a number of things that can damage stuff for when I can't reach with the goddamn knife, which happens a lot. It's extremely helpful. I was really hoping that would be the secret.
Bob's curse. Poison bombs. Yeah, sure, thank you. Extra bombs. Of uh, secret areas need exposed walls. I understand. I didn't before, but now I do. Or if I knew this information, I've, I had forgotten it. Uh, I don't really want that. I'm going to save it for a minute, though. Do I want this bum? Maybe. Maybe. It's the charge bum, but I'm not sure yet. Oh, it's a little dumpy again. A uh, little dumpy is fine. Dumpy, I'll take dumpy. Dumpy saves me. Dumpy has saved me before. Holy shit. I got it. Oh, damn it. the soul heart. Okay. I'm gonna hedge my bets with this bum. Oh! I mean... If I end up with full hearts, that's useful, but I'll, I'll take it, bum. Thank you. I spent 60-something on that bum in the previous run, and I spent, like, Three this time, and I got the item. Fuck. Or if I accidentally overcharge, which, yes, I'm very like to do. enough. I mean, my luck... Uh, I have a lot of luck at the moment, so that's probably why that happened. Explode keeper in shot... Ah, uh, no, it's okay. So, I'm, I'm assuming I'm going to want the uh, Polaroid? Invincibility when getting hit a half a red heart or none. Okay, and... Here we go. Okay. So this run is going absolutely incredibly. I don't want to jinx it, but holy shit!
Better hope you get a devil room next floor or Polaroid won't work. Right. So I've never seen any of this. Corpse one. I also have not heard this music. Always nice to hear a new Ridiculon track. I have heard it once? Oh, okay. Squeezy jibs. Vinny, you attempted this boss once. Great. I don't even remember. I Was that last year? Dear God. It was the last run you did. Okay, that's how I unlocked Rotten Hearts. Well, the boss room has been discovered. Uh, should I just go straight to it, or... What do I think of the new Mars Volta single? Uh, it was very good. I enjoyed it a lot. It took me like two listens and then I and then I got it. Oh yeah, I do remember this. It's just not everyone could be a pro gamer like me and be able to do the, the things that I do in this here video game like I do, you know what I mean? Skip the heart. No. Oh. Get rid of hearts. Um, this isn't gonna get rid of the hearts, is it? Orbital knife blocks enemy shots. Three knives. It's a three knives run. <sighs> Two, you use the third. Oh, that's gone. God, well, I mean, there were still knives. I had three. Well, I had two. Now I have... Yeah, so, never mind. I, yeah, that was... That was just a blunder. Find a way to get rid of your red hearts. I'll try. Now I... I have this many red hearts, though. Probably too late. Maybe. <laughs> Dumpy just saved me. I guess I may as well just take the hearts then, right? Forget the Polaroid at this point. Yeah. And I had... Kinda had the opportunity, but that room, that devil room... ...was not doing me any favors, because it wanted just to take my soul hearts. So even if I didn't grab that shit... Well, I officially... <laughs> 
have more charges than I know what to do with. Save two charges for the boss. Try. You can't, like, go invincible on that, right? Like, you need to sacrifice. Bomb the card. You just do this. It's more health. I'll hold on to it. Bombs. Key. Shot speed up. Shot speed up. Here we go. This is it, Luigi. Oh fuck. It's it's the real mother off. Oh. Did something. Did I do it? Oh, I got a bunch of achievements. Wow. What a fucking good run that was. I will miss this build. And most of us were like, yeah, the run is over, myself included. to me now this is what you think of me this is what i am to you a monster no no mom i've just after all i've done for you this is how you view me you think i'm a monster isaac i'll show you a monster no, 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 you are just like your father. I can't even look at you. How could you? You are just like him. <laughs> oh my god. Our father who art in heaven, hallowed by thee. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Jesus. Satania will be there for you. Vinny, you've unlocked the true ending path. You've also unlocked the worst fucking character. Oh, cool.
Is the message Jesus bad? No, I don't think the message is Jesus bad. I think message is... Mother was deeply disturbed. And I think... I think organized religion is probably not something that Ed is a big fan of. And, uh, you know, doctrine, extremists, brainwashing, you name it. It's like when uh, Monty Python did Life of Brian, they said they thought of ways to, like, make fun of Jesus, but they kind of couldn't. Because if you read what's there, like, he's just, a, like, a, a good dude. He's portrayed as, like, a good dude. And then they ended up taking the piss and making fun of everything around Jesus. The church, the, the followers, how it became, like, total disregard for his original intent. And I think that movie does a pretty good job at that. Anyway, I think that's what this is going for, maybe more. Yeah, what Desert had a good point. The religious aspects of this game are more about the psychotic beliefs of the mother and not the actual religion itself. True. But I mean... You know, there's a, a probably a number of different ways. As someone who has gone to Catholic school, as I've said, I'm qualified to answer this question, and I will say that, um, yeah, the actual the the Jesus is fine. It's just everything around the Jesus has been a complete and huge turnoff. It's like the more I learned and the more they tried to indoctrinate me, the more I turned away from it. But I'm into the Jesus at least. You know, like I appreciate his original message and the idea of being good to one another and, you know, uh, doing what you do to others like, as you would have done unto yourself as much as possible. I think that's a good message. It's just shit. Anyway, um, isn't it funny how this game about puking and vomiting and blood pussies <laughs> uh, ends up spurring this kind of conversation? Jacob and Esau. It's ice climbers. Is this supposed to be like Cain and Abel? Or, um... Isaac's sons? Oh, okay, because I don't remember my Bible studies. But, uh... Oh, I see. Hold Alt. Read the controls. I'm trying to. Oh, you can move them independently. Is this terrible? I'm good. They have separate hearts, too. Yeah, no, I, I'm good. All right, we're going to take a quick break. I'll get to some ace combat. Um, unfortunately, unfortunately, I'm not going to be able to play too much ace combat tonight. And that one chat member is going to end up leaving. But I would like to, because I'm kind of close to the end of the game, I would like to play it again. I'll think about playing it again soon. But yeah, let's, uh, or I'll give it a more substantial stream at some point. There's like five missions left. Okay. All right, everybody. Uh, give me just a minute. I'll be back. Thank you for watching. And thank you for helping with Isaac because soon there will be more Isaac. We'll get that true ending. <laughs>